friends, this is Janet with Photography Makes, and today is day two of Shark Week, and I hope you'll join us. It's hashtag Shark Week 2022, so Shark Week 2022, and today I made a, a, a hopefully a unique project, um, but this is it. Here's my little shark on the bottom here. And I decided I wanted to make like a little um, game spinner. So here it is, the little spinner spins. And so I designed my whole thing around this um, eight inch hoop from Dollar Tree. So here's the hoop. And I bought some digital papers from an Etsy shop called Paper Graphics design i'll link it below um they had paper and then like matching um like icons and stuff so like little digital stamps and they also had ones that weren't colored and ones that were just lines so you could color yourself um but i sometimes like to just print and go so those are the ones i picked today this time um but yeah so like these are all digital papers that i used this one has little bubbles. This one just is uh, green polka dots. And then the shark. Um, I also use this IO um, uh, die set. So it's number um, DIE077-W. So it's these really cool little seashells. They're actually quite a nice size. So that's what I used on the bottom here. And I put some stickles around them. Um, I went to my design space um, for my Cricut. And I started by um, taking a circle and shaping, um, sizing it to a size 8 inch. And then I took the triangle and then I started placing them in like pieces of pie. <laughs> so that's where I got this design. And then I started um, a second triangle that would fit in the middle of the first triangle. And then all I did was add a number and attached and flattened and then uh, print and cut. So that's how I ended up with the numbers on here. Um, why a spinner? I don't know. I just thought it'd be fun. So you spin it and you've got three seconds before that shark's going to get you. What are you going to do? So it could be like a fun way to introduce a game at a party or, you know, a night where you're just, <laughs> you know, hanging out with some friends and you, you ask those like weird questions that are sometimes fun. You know, like if you had a third, third arm, where would you place it kind of thing? So that's where the idea came from. So to get this ring to stay onto my piece of paper, I did use hot glue and then I decided to stitch around it to hide the hot glue, which it didn't. So then I hot glued this piece of yarn around the edge. I kind of wish I would have just stitched it and skipped the hot glue all together because it's a little bit messier than I would like it to be. I did it as neat as I possibly could, but sometimes that's um, hard, so. And then I made this little shark cluster with um, these little seaweed bits. So I cut a couple of those out. And my cool little shark here and some of the seashells. I also used this stuff from Dollar Tree. I don't know what you want to call it, but it's it was in the ribbon section, I believe. And um, it looks like fishnet to me, so I felt like kelp or something. Um, I added some plain green fabric to the bottom, also from Dollar Tree. And, um, and then I backed it with some foam core. So that's what the back looks like. And maybe I should stamp my stamp back here, but right now that's what the back looks like. And then for my spinner, I just used a Tim Holtz spinner, um, that I had, uh, laying around. So yeah, that is my project. I had a little bit of stickles and, um, a little bit of tool. And that is that. So I think this could be a fun little decor piece. You can hang it on a wall or, like I said, it's meant for like a little, a little game board piece. So yeah, I enjoyed making it. Okay, I hope you follow along and join in and I'll talk to you again soon. Bye.